All right, what we're gonna do is we're going to take these beads. These are deco beads. I got these at Hobby Lobby. Uh, they're the same thing as Orbeez. I couldn't find Orbeez. We're gonna put them in this water bottle. We're gonna add deer urine to them because they are water storing gel beads. And what that's gonna do, you're gonna pour these out in the woods and it's gonna extend your deer scent instead of just putting it on the ground and kind of evaporating. These are gonna stay there for a few days. I've already done this once. I put some of them in a mock scrape. I'll put some trail camera videos at the end of this video showing how the deer like it because they smelled it pretty good there. So I'm going to use a water bottle. I've already got some in here. You can hear them. They've already swelled up pretty good size. Just a little bit of water. We're going to add the Lit Liquor Deer Lure from Hoosier Trapping Supply. Hoosier Trapper Supply deer like this. They, uh, it's an all year deer lure. It's not really a, uh, a doe in heat. They come to this all year long. I think I paid 28 bucks for this 8 ounce bottle. It's a lot better than stuff you buy in the store, I think. So, set this down. Let's put them in here. I'll show you what they look like when you get them open. Just little bitty beads. If you know what Orbeez are, if you have kids, same thing as Orbeez. These are for a vase of flowers. They come from Hobby Lobby. So let's put them in here and see what they do. Swell up probably three times their size. And you add water to them. And then we're going to be adding deer yarn to them. So, I don't know how big they would swell up with this stuff. You get them poured in without making a mess in the yard. Just to add in there, so we're going to add some, and if it's not enough, we will add more later. I'll do a video of what the deer, well, I will add the trail cam videos of the deer already smelling ones of these that I've already done. And I'll show you what they look like after they swell up. You can buy deer scent gel beads. It's the same thing, you're just making your own. Like and subscribe. I hope you enjoy the video. All right, so I've got the uh, scent beads. They are all swelled out actually going to have to put them into a bigger bottle take this top off see if I can show you they're about to I screw it off they're going to try to come out you can see them hope you can I'm going to pour them into this bigger water bottle there's still some scent they has got to soak up in there had to add a little bit of water to it because the uh, back up so maybe you can see me had to add a little bit of water to the deer urine it might have watered it down a little bit but the beads when it's just deer urine only only swelled up about this far in the bottle so when I put a little bit of water in it they just started expanding on out there must be oil or something in that deer scent they didn't want to soak up as good but you can see they're brown and I can smell them with just the lid cracked Maybe my dogs won't eat it.
Yep, I dropped a bunch of them. That ain't crazy. pack of beads is supposed to make I think two quarts of these but you're not gonna really need two quarts of them there you go this will probably fill on out on up into the bottle I'm gonna keep them in a bottle or it'd be tight scent won't escape so, anyways that's a good way to extend your deer scent. When you put these on the ground, that scent's going to stay there for a couple of days instead of just pouring deer scent out, putting it on a rag and letting it drip into the soil where it's going to be absorbed. This should last three or four days, maybe more. Uh, anyway, give it a try if you want to. Like and subscribe if you don't mind.